Hello there viewers, so I'm back from holiday, let's have a look at the opponent today. So it's a new week and it's round two, let's have a look at this uh, Psycho Palpatine guy. And it's La Gildi Tranquil and it's Prodigal Knight, let's have a look at his GP. 4.6, wow I out GP an opponent, that's, um, that's quite a rare occurrence, look at that, I'm 4.9. That is quite rare. I don't normally get this, so this is quite lucky for me. Let's, let's have a look at his roster. So let's do it by gear. How many relics does this opponent have? 6, 12, 18, 24, 30. Wow, he actually has more G, uh, more relics than me. He probably should have a little bit more GP than me, actually, then. So let's have a look at gear 12. So he's got 12, 18. Okay, 18 gear 12s. And then it sort of drops off, although, yeah, he's got quite a lot of gear 11s. It drops off just before Malik. Hasn't got Malik up and running. That's interesting. That's um, that's something that you should have done quite early on. Darth Trayer is up and running effectively, but, uh, yeah, surprised about, about that. Trayer and Malik probably should have done something with those guys. Let's have a look at all the key players here. So the key players are going to be Padme. That's quite a lot of health, that's quite good, 114. Okay, I think that's the same speed as mine. Let's have a look at his unmasked. That's a lot of defense. 107, okay, that's pretty fast, that is pretty fast, but my Bounty Hunter team is just faster than that, so I could do that as an option if it's on defense. Let's have a look at his Jedi Revan. Jedi Revan is 129, wow, that's, that's fantastic. That's much more than, uh, than mine. Although that's not a complete set of that he's got there, so that's interesting. Let's have a look. Who else is key player here? General Skywalker. Speed and defense, interesting. One, two, seven. Okay. Well, mine mine is quicker than that, and it, and it's going to hit a bit harder than his. Let's have a look. Oh my God, he's got. I thought it was Farm Boy Luke, but it's Commander Luke. Never mind, never mind. Panic over, 99 speed, that's pretty pretty respectable. Let's have a look. Phasma, yeah, he's probably obviously going for Galactic Legend um, Kylo. Let's have a look. Rex. Rex is going to be pretty fast, surely. 147, fantastic, absolutely fantastic. Mine is just over the 300 mark, so he's done really, really well. Much better than mine. Absolutely fantastic. And he even has a green mod just to rub it in. Look at that. Right. Well, that is absolutely fantastic. The speed that he's got is pretty good. Let's just actually sort it by speed. He doesn't have Darth Revan up and running. Wow. Okay. Sith Empire is not his forte for some bizarre reason. That's a missed opportunity in my book. Sith Empire is just so, so handy. Not just in Galact not just in Grand Arena, but also in Galactic Conquest and also the Galactic Challenges. Wow, look at that. Okay. I think I'm pretty well, I feel very confident now. Let's have a look at his ships. That's a lot of relic ships there. So out of the ten ships, um eight of them are relic pilots. That is gonna be very tough for me. That is going to be very, very tough. Um, the Rebel Fleet doesn't look like it's up and running as much as mine, so I've got an advantage there. That's really, really good for me. Everything else looks pretty scary. So as long as he doesn't have his Republic Fleet on defense, I should be able to clear. It might be a bit difficult, but I should be able to clear them. Trimera, not really up and running by the looks of it, like just based on the Admiral. Really, really interesting. That is going to be, I think, it's the fleet battles is going to be really scary, I think. That's going to be really, really scary. So, with all that done and said, let's have a look at the defense that the opponent has set for me. I does what I like, and I like. I does what I like, and I like. What I do. I does what I like. Wow, okay. I think my opponent has attacked me pretty recently. Let's have a look at my defense. Let's have a look at damage that's been dealt. Okay, well, 
nothing. Okay, that's not good or bad. Don't know whether that's going to be enough damage. And wow, look at that. The fleet battles is complete victory. Complete and utter victory. Three fleets that he used and they're both still standing. Okay, I think I've won. But also that makes me a little bit scared that his negotiator is going to be on defense. So I might not be able to clear the uh, fleets. That's really annoying. Really annoying. Although if he has brought those heavy fleets on offense, then I don't know what on earth happened for him to lose. So I think the only plausible explanation is that he's gone weak offense, which I probably would not advise you do. Let's have a look at South Wall. Four holds with the Newt team. Look at that. Newt holding, well, three, three battles and then it took the fourth to actually clear. That is absolutely fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. And my Dooku is now recently gear 12 as well. So that team is only going to get better. That is, that is, wow. That is brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. As you can see, I've just got my dailies there and then let's have a look at the back wall geo brood is still standing after one battle and the phoenix squad look at that they even did they even joined in absolutely fantastic brilliant um i don't know what he did um i doubt that he used his sith triumphant because that should have cleared um my geos are pretty fast but they don't really have that much health and protection so it could be just the fact that because they hit hard, maybe that's why they won. But I'm a little bit confused as to how they've managed to get a hold there and they're still standing. Phoenix Squad, people always underestimate them. I'm really happy that they uh, always catch people out. So let's have a look at the opponent's defense and then I'll deal with my dailies. So let's have a look at the north first. Let's have a look. That's going to be difficult. That, that Kira team is going to be difficult. Might need to use my Bounty Hunters after all on there. And the that's quite an odd trio. I think that's Sunfang, isn't it? That's, who is that? What Geo is that? That is the Sunfang. Okay. Interesting. I don't know why you would do the Taunt for that team there. Interesting. Yeah, okay. Those ones are not too scary. I think I can, I can work around those. That'll be fine. Hux and Phasma are not really that great in 3v3 or 5v5. South Wall. G General Grievous. Okay, that's going to be interesting. That Geo lead is exactly the same lineup I do with Pogo. That's really, really good. I and mean, then he's put his Bounty Hunters on defense. I don't get why people put their Bounty Hunters on defense, especially those three. Like Bosk, Grief, and Mando. You do not put those three on defense ever. Well. I've got some interesting stuff to deal with. I'm going to have a think about it whilst I do my dailies. And then we'll go back in and do the battles on the south wall first. And then we'll see what surprise he's got on the back wall here. So let me just do my stuff and then I'll come back. There you go, three minutes is all that took. So let's have a look again. Let's deal with this team first. This one's going to be the scary one. Right, 501st versus Poggle and Droids, basically. Um, let's see whether I can try and take out Droidica quick. Ooh, okay, well, that's a good thing that B1 only healed up. Poggle. Oh, wow, look at that. I think that was damage over time. That was fantastic. Right, well, I've lost banners, unfortunately. That's unfortunately something that you can't really recover with this uh, lineup. Maybe it might have been overkill, but uh, 51 banners, I'm happy with that. So let's just move on. We'll take it. Let's deal with General Grievous with the Jedi Revan team. Here we are, so unfortunately that is really bad that he's under stealth, but B1 looks like he's about to take a turn, and like clockwork, there we go. In we go, now that he's exposed, we'll just deal as much damage as we can. I think Yoda might do this. Oh, so close. Let's deal some stealth. Good. Let's do some damage on Magna God. Wow, that was some good, 
10 meter removal as well let's get some bonus protection back let's just do some taps on general grievous as well this magna guard is pretty thick actually oh i lost lost a few banners back oh no i've, I've yeah i've lost one banner Damn, how on earth did Dr General Grievous take off the banner when I've got Foresight? I don't get that. I don't get how that happened. He had Foresight. And the other two still have their bonus protection, but Master Yoda didn't. Mysteries of the game. I don't know whether that's a bug or not, but I hope that doesn't cost me that one banner. Let's move on. And let's deal with Bosk. So here we are. So I'm not going to take any risks i'm gonna do this by the books i'm gonna try and take out this team with a half decent team now i think grief cargo might heal up these guys in a mo but let's just try and take out mando there we go good 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 oh i probably should have done something with the stealth actually i don't know whether i can take out grief cargo in time this is a risk against time. I don't know whether this is enough. Oh, I was so close. I was so close, but there we go. We've, we've got that back. Let's try and get a stun. No, no stuns. We, this this team has been modded quite well. Right, let's do one X. Do a big hit. There we go, Luke. Well done. I know that was... Well, maybe that's part of his plan, is making me use a half-decent team. But I definitely... I'm glad that I did it. I'm glad that I did that. So let's do this and we'll take the banners and we'll take the credits. Let's have a look on the back wall now. I'm only 500 banners away from a win. Let's have a look on the back wall. Wow, he went pretty defense heavy actually. I'm surprised. Very, very surprised. Okay, let's, let's deal with the front wall first and then we'll see what we've got on the back. Gee, wow, he... Yeah, this is not going to be easy. <laughs> not going to be easy at all. Let's do the Bounty Hunters against Kira. Right, Bounty Hunters, in we go. Oh, still on cinematic. Let's just get the taunt back up. Let's try and get this payout as quick as possible. I hope we don't get stuck behind Emphas Nest. Oh, I think we probably might... We might get stuck behind her. Oh, this might actually... Hey, wow, look at that. We've got the payout. Just fantastic timing. Let's just do this because I think we might lose banners. I think Grief Cargo is just a little bit late. I don't know whether we're going to... I don't know whether we're, we're going to be able to take her out. She keeps on coming back with, because we've got the potency. Oh, Oh, there we go, we've done it, we've done it, yes, <laughs> we did it at last, we managed to get rid of the potency up, wow, that's actually a really good lineup, I think, that's, he's onto something, I've never done that before, I think if Cara Doom was a bit of a higher gear, that would be really annoying, but that was fantastic, that was a fantastic team, now, yes, they lost, and I got full banners, but I'm still really impressed with that lineup, <laughs> really impressed. Let's deal with this top team up here. Now this one is a risk. I'm full. I'm fully aware of how much of a risk this is going to be. Let's just try and do as much damage as possible. Let's try and get this payout. Unfortunately, we've got to give that. Let's just do this. Let's try get this payout come on Boba Fett I needed you to do a double tap there oh that stun's not good and the ability block that is such bad oh I think I've lost yep extortion has spread and it's now lo looking good I think I've got to try and back out I don't think I can do anything there I've got to back out that's really bad that is really really bad Let's do that again. Unfortunately, this team is making me use a really half-decent team. 
let's go into MM and let's do the dots on him. Fantastic. Probably should have done this first off, but I was trying to save Darth Vader for another line of, of offense. This is not good. This is just made me waste a half decent team. I know there's extortion that's going to spread now, but let's just let's just try and move on. Let's just get this over with. I don't think I'm going to get full banners, unfortunately, as well. So this is going to be oh, this is going to take a while. Come on, Royal Guard. Oh, come on, Piat. There we go. Damn, I wanted to use that team against one of the First Order ones. So I've lost an Empire team and a Bounty Hunter team. That very annoying. Right, let's, let's do this one up here. Now, this team has worked before. So let's hope that it can do it again. Uh, yeah, I need to get rid of that taunt. There we go. Absolutely perfect. Let's try and work on Sith Trooper. He's got the ability block, so that's really good. Let's just recover some of that lost banners bonus protection. Come on, Kenobi. You're carrying the team at the moment. Let's get some of that counter-attacks out of the way. Oh, oh. One more, and then we've done it. We've done it. Good, good, good. Let's go for Hux, although that looks pretty weak from Hux. Let's get some bonus protection back. Let's do this. Come on, let's take him out. His protection was not that good, but his health is holding on. Oh, bad, bad timing. Bad timing. I used the wrong ability at the wrong time. Now we're stuck behind the taunt. Let's just swarm. Let's... Okay, well, we've dealt with him. There we go, come on. Come on. One more hit, Kenobi. Or is it Bastila? It is, no, it's going to be Kenobi. It is Kenobi. He was the main man there. Wow. General Kenobi leading the charge. Fantastic. Full banners. That's, that's more like it. That is definitely more like it. Right, this is going to be an attempt to recover some banners lost. So, in we go. Malik is got the benefit of the Darth Maul lead. Let's see how far we can go. I might need to put this on fast forward, but we'll see how well this goes. Let's just try and take out First Order. Ah, so close. There we go. Right now, we've got to try and go for First Order Special Forces TIE Pilot. That's a hell of a long name. Special, special op guy. Let's just take him out. There we go. Just like... Uh, the officer and I think Phasma looking pretty thick here actually. Uh, there we go, we got the stun and then the finishing blow. There we go. 52 ah oh, wasn't really really recovering banners, was it? 52. Okay, well there we go, we'll take 52 then. And right, the north wall is now clear. Now we've got the very difficult job of the south wall. Let's It's going to be very, very difficult. Very, very difficult. Let's try and take out the Geos with Sith Empire. I'm doing the Sith Empire against the Geos because there's no, I've got no confidence that my Gear 11 is going to stand up to firepower of relics. Let's try and hope the, my Sith Empire can do this. Lost the... Come on. Come on, Bastila. Can we do it? Yes, we can. There we go. Good. 53. Well, we got it. 53. I'm happy with that. It's a win. Let's deal with... Oh, I don't know. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Right, let's take out the first order here. Right, well, we've got them here. So let's just try and work on the premise of taking out at least the executioner. Oh, my God. Looks like we're going to be lucky to do even that. That's not looking good. <laughs> not looking good at all. Um, let's pass that over. Let's... Come on. Let's do this. Come on. Let's take out one of them at least. 
If I manage to somehow do this with these two guys, I'll be gobsmacked. Come on. Wow, it's looking pretty good actually. Let's do this. Um, yeah, this normal Kylo is going to take a while, I believe, to deal with. The stum's absolutely perfectly timed. Let's just do a big hit. Hopefully this will work and pay off. Didn't, didn't pay off. And the fracture disappeared very quickly there. Let's try it. Come on. Come on. Let's do this. Take him out. Take him out. One more hit. There we go. Wow, look at this. This is an absolute turnaround from the very beginning. This is fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. We might be here for a while because I think... Yeah, Unmasked Kylo just keeps on getting all these different debuffs and it's taking a while to deal with. Let's just keep on doing shock and let's not do any new ability. I healed him up a little tad there. Let's do this. One more hit. Come on. Come on, Emperor. One more. Thrawn did it. Thrawn did it. Absolutely fantastic. 51. Wow. The opening hit. I really thought this was just going to be awful. Thrawn and Palpatine just carried the team there. Absolutely fantastic. Fantastic work from the boys there. The Empire. Absolutely fantastic team. That is, wow. I'm only two banners behind. Two banners. Okay, we've definitely got to clear Night Sisters. Might be a risk, but Night Sisters versus. Sif Triumphant, let's try and get some uh, decent wins. Right, let's do this. I think I should be able to win if I can face punch um, a Sarge, basically. Because she shouldn't then be able to come back. Let's do this. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Come on. Well, we got a stun. Don't know whether that's going to do anything. Don't know whether it did. Right, let's see whether it works. It should. It's what the kit says. And then old Daka will probably tr be trying to revive her. To no avail. There we go. It actually worked. There we go. I know how to read kits, people. Absolutely fantastic moment in gaming history. <laughs> right, let's pass that over. Oh, oh, good, 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 good. I thought I misplayed. I thought I just um, isolated old Daka. Wow, look at this. Come on, boys. Bring it home. One more hit on old Daka and then she's gone. It's taken a very long time to get around to doing this. Oh, come on, Nihilus. Nihilus, you, you're costing me, boy. You're costing me. There we go. Right. The boy that knew how to read kits is about to win. Absolutely fantastic. A second face punch. And there we go, game over. Look at that, 51 banners as well. Gear 11, Sif Triumphant, absolutely fantastic. I'm really happy with that, really, really happy. I mean, I should in theory just be able to clear the Jedi team here and I've won the game, won, won the round, so let's do it. It might be a misplay, but unfortunately this is all I've got to deal with this lineup. Oh, I needed that taunt as soon as possible. Come on. Right, let's try and take out Mace Windu. He's clearly the biggest threat here. Let's try and recover some health. Oh, actually, it's Bastila that I need I should have been taking out. Oh no. I think Calf might be might be gone. Oh, Calf is gone. He's gone, gone, gone. Right, let's try and take out Bastila. That's what I should have been focusing on in the first place because the cleanup is going to be so much more easier if she's not around. Let's do this. Come on, boys. Come on, Zalbara mission. I think this is actually the map that we're on is supposed to be the, the sewers as well. So this is very fitting that they're 
here. Let's come on. Although, is this going to be another Thrawn and Palpatine moment? I think it is. Look at that. Two people carrying the team once again. Wow. 51 banners. I'm really impressed. I'm really impressed. I was... I was not expecting to get a full clear with the characters at least. I don't think I'm going to do it with the fleets, but I'm very happy with that. I can't believe I misplayed, but it's bound to happen. Absolutely bound to happen. That was a really, really good character. A few battles there. <laughs> really good, apart from this one up here. Although I, I had to do something different because by the end I was pretty much stretching my roster. So the opponent has done a really good job of uh, making this not easy. Yeah, that new team, you just can't sleep on. You can't sleep on it. So let's have a look at what surprises the opponent has left for me on the fleet battles. Right, we're here with the fleet battles. Let's have a look at the uh, fleet here. It's definitely Kenobi. It's the Kenobi ship, everybody. It is what I expected, but I don't think I need to really fight it. So let's go and deal with the Chimera first. Here we are, this is the lineup I'm going to take. Um, I'm probably just only going to try and do this battle. There's probably no point doing the Kenobi one. Chimera versus Chimera, but I've got more synergy by the looks of it than the opponent on defense. So let's hope that the synergy is enough. Here we go. Chimera versus Chimera. Let's try and take out Kylo as soon as possible. Um, right, let's try and get breached on someone else if possible and then we can get the seismic charge going oh we might be able to do this come on boba fett take a turn take a turn boba fett let's get xanadu blood in let's see whether we can reduce the health of bosk 1x let's do it come on there we go, very, very close to getting Bosk out as well. This battle has just made, has just become much more easier. Um, what do I want to do here? Just do this, get more offense. We've got defense down, which is really good. Hmm. I don't know if that was a misplay or not. Tough to tell sometimes whether it is. I don't have hindsight. Let's call in Bounty Hunter IG and let's do a big stun here if we can. I think we did. Right, tap, that's good. And then we should have... Oh, oh no, that's not good. That is definitely not good. We've got to heal up the Razor Crest here. Let's take out Bosk. There we go. And then we've got to try and take out this guy with Xanadu Blood. Didn't do a follow up. Oh no. Right. Let's do the Seismic Charge. Don't miss. Do not miss. And we've got the win. We got the win. Fantastic. 63. Seismic Charge was the MVP there. Boba Fett. Well done. 63 banners. I'll take that. We've got some good banners of that. I think we've got some good banners there. That was really good. 63, I'll take that. Right. Let's have a laugh and see how pathetic my follow-up fleet is against this uh, OP fleet. Let's have a laugh. Let's just uh, throw in make the opponent feel better no oh, it's still on 1x it's still on cinematic 
Um, well, let's just go for Anakin, I suppose. There's not really much else I can do. Because the Y wing should be. Oh, there you go. That's that's what you pay for with this fleet. That is exactly what you want. I don't think there's any way that I can uh, salvage anything from this. It's just really sad that he went defense heavy because it screwed both of us up. Let's, uh, I don't know, let's just do this. It's just a uh, constellation hits, really. It's not really um, going to change the world. Oh, that's that's a shame. I could have got one ship out at least, but it doesn't look like we're going to be allowed to. No, we're definitely not going to be allowed to. There you go. Well, that's the defeat. That's what we all knew was going to happen. Make the opponent feel better that he uh, got a victory over me on some something there. And it just really comes down to uh, the fleets. Look at that. I'm really happy with that. I'm, I'm hoping that the opponent doesn't win somehow. I, I don't think that's going to happen. Really good round. The um, the opponent put up a much tougher defence than I was expecting. And I'm surprised that he managed to clear what he did with characters that we can work out together. And you can sort of see that he yeah he, he did do, do very well. Actually a little bit disappointed that he didn't full clear all the characters like I did. Because fleets, yes that was a mistake from both of us. Not maybe going offence heavy enough. But... The characters, we we both put down pretty tough defences and it was only just by pure luck that I managed to clear all the characters. And uh, yeah, he, he pretty much unfortunately got held up with that new team down here. I think that was the saving grace for me, was that team holding for so long because I'm assuming that that then drained a lot of his good characters and good teams, which then meant but it was a drain on the black wall here when he didn't have anything to really take it on. I would love to know what he used first off. Maybe he tried to do what I did, which was bounty hunters, but just not going to work. Not going to work at all. Let's have a look and see whether we got any feats. No, we didn't, but we are in the top 150. Well, top 120. I'm really happy with that. No feats. Yeah, no feats. Well... I'm happy with all of this. It's going really, really well. Hopefully, we'll be able to get Kyber next week, especially with me keep on win winning like this. My unbeaten run is from August, and I think this is win 24 or 25. Fantastic winning run. So let's just see whether I can keep it up. So until next time, may the force be with you.